How's it going YouTube? Chris here in my home theater. Got a brand new video for you today. Today we're going to be looking at a, a handheld wireless vacuum cleaner uh, that was sent to me about a month ago from the company Cool. And it is a four in one vacuum cleaner and cleaner. Uh, uh, looks like it's a pretty cool little app. So uh, let's turn the camera around and open the box and check it out. So and this is it. It is the Cool. 401 vacuum cleaner and a cleaner and uh, comes in this nice little zip case as we can see and we'll find a zip for it and, and there it is so this is the little handheld cleaner and as you can see it it's just in your hand it's kind of lightweight i mean it's got a little weight to it but it's got to it's got a had the motors for it to turn it so you got your filter in there and that filter and we got an extra one here look at that it's metal so it's easy to clean easy to clean which i guess if you wanted to suck up some water you use that one because this one is not metal so this one is metal and you got your little uh user manual here tells you how to use it and stuff it's pretty cool it's pretty cool guys and you got your attachments here you got your usb charging and and this, this thing right here what these do is we'll, we'll get up with that in a minute um the round ones here because if you see we can't put a round hole in the front. So what do you do? So you, then you have this one that attaches here. But what you do with these right here, it's hard to do this in one hand, is that actually, it actually goes in the rear like that. So when you turn it on, make sure I got it in there good. So when you turn it on, I got to charge it. And you mash it again. It's actually, it's blowing. It's blowing the stuff. It's pretty cool. The battery's going deep. So I got to charge it. So we're going to charge this thing. And then we're going to try this thing out. And so far, guys, it looks pretty good. It does have good suction to it. And uh, that's where you charge it up at. We're going to give this thing a charge. And then we're going to put it through the works because I got some, some dirt and stuff that's got down into my couch in my home theater. And uh, we're going to do our best to kind of get that out. And we're going to take it outside. And we're going to see about vacuuming in the floor. I mean, this might be something that you can stick in your car. If you go to car shows like I do and stuff, take that thing and vacuum it up real quick. After you, after you get to the car show, you may have some dirt in there. Uh, so it's, it's got a bunch of different stuff to work with, and we're going to try it out, and we'll be back after we get it charged. But All right, guys, so we are back. So I'm going to cover what uh, these little tools are here. So this one is a crevice tool, and I'm reading this straight from the, uh, the book. And, it's, uh, of course, you're going to use it like in your seats and you know, on your cars and door panels, and they said cabinets and ashtrays, drawers. So, I mean, you got your angle on it, so you get in there and you can get into the crevices. So the next one is a blow nozzle. And like I say, this is the one that hooks onto the rear of it. And it's applicable for blowing doors. Like if you want to, you know, blow stuff around in there or blow it out. Or if you got dust somewhere, let's just say you, you're working on something and you need to blow the dust out of the way, you can do that. So the next two are brushes. Now, this one is for the vacuum. You stick on the front and you can uh, brush as you're sucking up the whatever you're trying to suck up. Uh, and this one, I don't know exactly how this one fits in there because it's round. It ain't going to fit in the back, but uh, it hooks on to something. So it says it's a brush nozzle. It's both sucking and wiping. 
for dust and trunks and all kinds of stuff. So we'll, we'll figure this one out. Uh, the next one is this one. And this is what you can use to inflate your, uh, like you, you got your pool, you got your little uh, life vest, or you got your uh, little uh, life rings, life preservers, and whatever, whatever you need to blow up. So you can use this right here. And this one, you actually use it for vacuum sealing. And what you do is you take the front off here, and this connects directly to this, and you would stick it on whatever kind of packaging you got. If you want to vacuum seal uh, some clothes, and it sucks it down real good, and you can store it, make storage easy. So we'll be right back. All right, guys, we're back. We're going to try this little crevice tool out. As you can see, my couch here, and I've tried to get this out, wiping it out or whatever. So let's uh, just turn this thing on. Guys, pretty much. I mean, unless that's uh, the seams or something. That might, might be the seams. Pretty much got it out. We got another side over here we're going to try. Guys, look at her. One more side. Oh, I got some stuff on the floor here. I'm about to put this rug down. See how this goes. Look at that. Look at that, guys. That is pretty cool. And that wasn't even on the high settings. So, hey, it works in the crevices here. Let's go try it out in the car. All right, guys, we're back. And as you can see, I got some uh, dirt where my daughter's been riding around in here. So let's, uh, let's see, let's get this stuff out of here. Guys, that 100% did a good job, guys. I think it worked pretty good. Uh, yeah, I mean, you're not going to use this to totally vacuum out your car, but if you got it vacuumed and let's just say you going somewhere, you're going out, and you're like, man, I need to, I need to vacuum a car real quick, but you already have it up kept, you can take this and get the fine particles off the uh, the top, like if you going to a car show or like going out to eat and you want to impress the ladies or the guys if you're a lady um so i mean i think it does 
pretty good. Let's do it in the spot over here. This is always a bad spot. As you can see, it's working it pretty good. Getting to it. Yeah. Hey guys, that is pretty neat. My rice burner. All right, guys, so we're back, and this is how this thing attaches. If you want to have uh, to blow some, let's just say some dust or something out of the way, let's just say you're in your car. Car is what I would say this is probably best used for. So if you're in your car and you really can't uh, get things backing up like you want to, so you would blow it and you could rub it with the, the brush and uh, it would break it loose and blow it out of the way. So I think that's a pretty cool item. Uh, also, uh, with the crevice tool, you actually hook uh, this on the end of the uh, crevice tool. It's hard to do this with one hand, but we're going to turn this thing around here. And there you go. So it hooks on there. So that way you suck it up, rub it as you're sucking it up. And, you know, that's how it works, guys. Um, and then you do have the, uh, that's the regular filter. Uh, I think it has metal or something on it, but this is actual uh, metal, metal filter. And, uh, guys, I mean, this thing is a uh, pretty cool multi purpose tool. Uh, to use in your home or in your car, uh, but for me, uh, this would this would definitely be in the car. I mean, going to car shows, uh, try to keep my car vacuumed out pretty good. But getting in and out of the car, you're gonna get some little dirt and stuff in there. So before we, when I get to the car show, this would definitely uh, it would get it out, guys. And if you need to inflate, uh, if you got a swimming pool and you need to inflate your little. Uh, life ring or whatever you want to call it float or just anything I mean you know, vacuum seal I mean it's a multi-purpose and uh, and I think it works pretty good uh, there is a link below in the description and it will send you to uh, the Amazon uh, where you can pick this up uh, guys so that's it hope you enjoy and I definitely pick up the little multi-purpose uh, cleaner, vacuumer, compact, cordless for your car, for your home. Check it out.